Hello and welcome back my lovely heartbeats to another video here on my channel. First time reborn mom. And here's my sweet baby girl journey. I know you guys have not seen her in such a long time. But as you can see she is still here with me. And she is just as gorgeous. Wait, let me get this out of her mouth so you can see. She is just as gorgeous as ever. Yes, she is just as gorgeous as ever. So, I have been dreading taking her out of this outfit, y'all, because I absolutely love her in this outfit. Look how her skin wrinkled up. That is so cute. I just love it. I love it. Um, But I've been dreading taking her out of this outfit. I absolutely love it. And this is not even hers. This came with my Savannah Joy, my newest reborn that I got for my birthday um, for myself that had came from um, Africa. So um, this is what Savannah had came home in, but it was so cute and I had changed her out of it and um, Journey was just sitting up here naked. So I'm like, let me see if y'all can fit the same clothes. And um, they were able to fit the same clothes. So I was really, really happy about that. But um, as you all know, happy Thanksgiving to everyone that celebrates. And for those of you who um, do not celebrate, you know, then um, I still hope you have a wonderful day. Enjoy time with your families or whatever you guys are doing. Um, so I'm going to get her out of this outfit and she's going to put on this Will Beth outfit that I have been holding on to um, since 2018. I got it at the Rose Dial Show. I bought it from um, Jacqueline Kramer's booth, actually. She is known for selling her, um, her knits and stuff, Spanish knits. Um, and it is just this beautiful beautiful layette it has a little it's a three month size and like I said it's a Will Beth um, but it's a cream long sleeve sweater and it has like some little knit down at the bottom designs three buttons really cute so well made so very well made that's the back there and it has a little hat to match it with the pants oh these look so big journey she ain't gonna be able to fit this I'm looking at this now and a beautiful blanket with that infamous Will Beth signature there but the look at that blanket so pretty so um like I said I bought this from Jacqueline Kramer's booth I'm gonna have to do some photos with that um because that's really pretty um, I got that from Jacqueline Kramer's booth in 2018 at the Rose Dial Show. Oh my goodness, you guys. Leave me a comment down below. What are you missing most about the Dial Show? Are you missing um, seeing the babies? You know, seeing different artists work? Are you missing interacting with your, um, you know, with your love? nieces and nephews and your dolly aunties and you know your other dolly baby mamas or um you know just the interaction are you missing the games and all of the fun you know what i'm saying being able to touch and hold and experience silicone dolls what is the fake taking the classes what is what are you missing the most so if we can't go to the dial show we can at least talk about the dial show and um oh oh my goodness journey i just scratched a mess out your face i don't know if y'all seen that but i scratched her face and it kind of like let me bring her up close so i scratched her face uh i scratched her face up here and it kind of like rubbed off her layer of matting um, but that's okay because she just got a fresh layer of matting. So she is buttery, buttery smooth right now. Um, and I know how to, I do fortunately know how to do her myself. But that was really rough. I got to, I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened right there. But, um, 
yeah glad it i'm glad that she is well made and i been taking excellent care of her so you guys do y'all remember me telling you that journey had a um had an accident with her armature and her armature um her armature was snatched out of one of her arms y'all her armature was snatched out of this arm right here and i don't know if you can see where it's shiny right in there i'm in the light now so it done changed but right there right in there so and then that's what this is from too because it pulled she pulled it so much she separated it and that's where that color distortion that came from right there but she, journey arm was separated her armature was poking out of her arm but i did go in and i fixed it and um tried to adjust her paint color <clears throat> right there so and i was able to do it so she does um she has her full armature in her right arm but her left arm she only has it in her shoulder up to about right before her elbow because i had to also cut it back trim it and roll it into her silicone to make sure that it wouldn't poke through had to go in seal that silicone and um paint the seam right there and um rematter so yeah my little baby had a, um that's why it's so important to watch little kids when you having them over when you having them over around your dolls or you when you have your dolls out because they just so rough you know they don't mean to be that rough but they just so rough they don't realize how delicate these babies are look at these big old pants it's so big but i still want her to wear it three months let's see if you can pull it off i already got it out our video is going so we're gonna see if you can pull it off i have some um i know i have some thanksgiving um themed clothes but i just can't find them right now and with me trying to cook and trying to put up the decorations and me trying to do these videos and change babies. It's just like, I can't get it all done. <laughs> I cannot get it all done, y'all. I can't get it all done. So, it's okay. And I apologize for my lack in videos. Um, I had a lot going on, like, ever since my anniversary. It's like, my anniversary... Um, my birthday my husband's birthday and um everything is just like bam 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 one after another after another and um then we got you know covid and me being laid off and me trying to supplement my income doing other things that take up a lot of my time so i apologize for my lack of videos but um now that i am getting more structured into a schedule you can look forward to having me and the babies back in you guys' lives, in your homes, and on your phones. Uh-oh, I lost her hand, y'all. I lost her hand. I don't like to pull it through if I don't have a good hold on her hand. Because I'm kind of like using my hand. <laughs> this My skin is like a guide to slide it down. So... The fabric is not rubbing on her silicone. And this is too big. It is, but you know what? She is going to wear it today because I ain't about to change it. But my new baby, I know will be able to fit this. I got a new baby coming, y'all. But since she got this on already... She gonna be wearing this today. It's not so bad, I guess. Let me see. It's not so bad. That white underneath is really washing it out. But let me see. I'm gonna pick you up and lay you on your blanket. On your blanket, Jern. Oh, it's so pretty. Baby girl got to get her hair done, y'all. Y'all remember I rerouted re her hair? <laughs> it's much thinner now. 
I used a different texture here and I didn't root it as thick but um that was the look that I was going for for her I wanted to be able to see her scalp um and then um, her scalp had her little silicone her scalp had been through so much from me pulling out the other hair and rooting it I wanted to make sure that I gave her a look that was gonna do her face justice and I just wanted to change it up it kind of made her look a little different she can look she looked like a girl or a boy sometimes depending on what I have her on you know she can she can do girl or boy. Oh, look at that baby. Look at that baby. Look at that baby. <laughs> she can do girl and boy. Especially like when that hat be half on her head like that. Boy all day long. Boy all day long when that hat be like that. And I don't even mind her looking like no boy. She got her little earrings. But that's that's part of the realistic. That's part of the realism. You know because you see babies you be like. Oh man looking for the color. I don't know if it's a boy or if it's a girl. Oh my goodness Journey. You look so precious baby. You're like I don't know if it's a boy. I don't know if it's a girl. But that baby is cute that baby is beautiful and that's all that really matters look at there look at that baby so i am gonna find her some socks you guys what do you think can she get away with this outfit is it too big is it too big or can she do it i think she can do it so well this is what it's gonna be for the day anyway and i appreciate you staying with us watching this video if you have not given this video a thumbs up i ask that you take this opportunity right now and give us a thumbs up leave us a comment below and we'll see you in the next video thanks for watching bye